What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with part 4 of our Imperator campaign and we are planning to consolidate our power in Greece even more. I will uh, eventually go in for Thrace when the time is right, but right now we have claims in Greece and we have a good opportunity to solidify our, um, our grip over it basically. So we can uh, declare war on Epidurus. I will wait for my manpower to go up a little bit more, don't worry. Um, but we can declare war on Epidurus, bring Sparta which are down here, Aetolia, which are here, Heraleia, which are here, and uh, Kaidonia, which are, I'm pretty sure they're like this a bit, yeah, I'm probably not going to get involved in there, just yet, Crete can stay out of the war a little bit longer, but, um, but yeah, we'll start, and we'll see what happens, we've got a few things going on, we've got um, disloyal characters, you're very disloyal, and I don't think I'm ever going to be able to turn you, because even if I bribe him, he's still disloyal, and I don't really want to waste power on him when I could be using it elsewhere. I'd like to boost my um, stability, so I might wait um, to before I do my next omen. But yeah, we'll um, we'll see what happens. And then what else we got? Pretend to support. I can man. But you're really old. I I don't care if you support a different heir. To be honest. And we're going to bring this army down to um, just support in the invasion. Probably put it there. Because I would like to strike a Aetolia and Epidurus fairly quickly. Then we can go for Sparta. If I could actually integrate Athens, that would be great. Ooh, should we be able to integrate you? Not Athens, um, Argos. And we should be able to send a gift. That should... S and then we can start integrating them very soon. We need about 30 more. Yeah, we need like 30 more. I don't know which one I'd rather have. I'll go for that one. Oh, no, don't want to cancel that. I don't really need the legitimacy. I'm going to accept that. I am planning to actually break these guys up and expand because it would be better to have them part of Macedon than, like, just a vassal. But we'll get around to that eventually. I just thought I'd just put that in there just to let you guys know. Nesotic League. Where are you, then? Oh, you're, like, Na you're Naxos. Oh, so Naxos is been lost to um, Egypt. Oh no, this bit here, the Aegean Islands, they still hold. So dumb that you hold these Egypt. Oh, you don't hold that one though. Hmm, very strange. I'll probably fight Egypt for them at some point. Um, I will take the the unrest, I think. Um, if we declared war on you, who do we bring in? Kokara, Akania, Zarnia. Okay, so that might be interesting for another war. Tulantir. I was planning on taking you out at some point. Only reason in Dardania now. I might convert. Do some con convert actions there in a bit. But we'll see. So we'll, uh, we'll just have to sit, sit here and see and wait for a little bit. Just wait until we get to about 30,000 manpower, which we're just about... Well, we're not really halfway, but we're getting there. Oh yeah, we are halfway. We're well over halfway. Don't know what I'm on about. And um, we could bring in discipline for Boeotian helmet, or we could do some other things. I think I'm going to do discipline, get my troops to be a little bit more um, strong in combat, stand a little bit longer. We'll see whether we can uh, do that. But um, yeah, we sh we'll uh, wait wait out a little bit and then just go for Epidurus in about 10,000 10, manpower time, whatever that is. <laughs> but um, I hope you guys are really enjoying uh, the, ep uh, the, ep the episode, the series. And if you are, then uh, please let me know by hitting the like, bu like button. Jesus, I am English is not good this morning. Um, and, okay, so loyalty for him, or, 
I'm gonna go with loyalty for my general. I'd rather have my general very loyal. I'm gonna also put some granaries in. Um, and if you're new around here, please subscribe. I would really appreciate it because, um, well, just every little bit helps, really. I could do with every bit of support. Um, but yeah, so if you guys, like I said, if you guys got any way that you want me to invade and occupy next, then please let me know. Oh my god, we're getting so many gifts. Just gift after gift. Give me manpower gifts, please. Um, if you've got any way that you want me to attack, just let me know and I will take into suggestion. Um, you're very loyal. We sent all our loyal people. Um... He's not doing anything. He is a researcher. He is not a researcher. I'm gonna keep him so I'll send Hamakas. That is the plan. Um, no, Epidurus, because we're gonna go to war with you soon. Though actually Epidurus is in a war. It might be time to go to war, I'd say. Oh, and we lose... Aeolia. Have they gone to war with Aeolia by any chance? I might do it. I might go to war. In a bit. I make. Ah, I don't know. It's a good time. Good time to do it. But also, oh, Epidurus giving me money before. Just before I'm allowed to go to war with them. That's silly. That is silly. Right. Oh, better luck next time. We lose again. I don't think I've ever won an Olympic Games yet. I mean, many people can say that quite happily. It's a very small part of the population, even currently today, that, like, win something at the Olympic Games. But anyway, let's... What are you winning, then? Oh, they're calling us... I'm going to say no. I'm going to break my alliance. They wouldn't come to my wars anymore, so... I'm going to break the alliance and I might make an alliance with they would but they're a local power and they're a regional power they oh they would actually remake their alliance wow I feel bad that I broke it but hey Phrygia would you have an alliance I don't really want an alliance with you you imagine yeah as I imagined not right Rome would you want an alliance could offer you an alliance, but you just hate me so much. No, Sparta, you can have none of that. Carthage, would you want an alliance? No, why would you not want an alliance? Oh, they're a major power. I'm a regional power. Wow. Wow. Bianth, Bianthia, whatever. Thrace is on the other side now. It's actually into Asia. Jeez. Anyway, I think I'm going to go to war, because we're like 5,000 off what I wanted to, and they're like in their own war. They're in their own war and stuff like that, so we can just sit here and do whatever. Who's this bringing in anyway? It's bringing in Sparta, Herea, Ky I don't think any of these nations have got large enough armies to actually fight back. Sparta won't doesn't have a large one. Jeez, Aeolia's got a big army. Oh, that's like Arcania and Ellis as well. Okay. Ellis would want an alliance? Yeah, they would if they were a larger power, but they're not, obviously. Athens want an alliance. I just want some alliances now that I've, like, broken my own one. Um, can I give you more money? Yes. And then we can start integrating. Oh, we can't actually. Useless. Lemon useless. I'll wait one more then spend a bit more money on you. But we'll just siege this out and then uh, we should just romp through and take the other ones. Do we have, mil I imagine we have military access, access through, um, yeah, through their land. So we just go in, take Sparta. Jobs are good. Enough. Sparta's actually been lost to Messenia. It's like my Wrath of Sparta campaign. Jeez. If you haven't checked out my Wrath of Sparta campaign, I would uh, advise you that you do so. It is a very, very good ca campaign. Um, lose 
Or I will spend the money and just keep my legitimacy and all that. I also want to spend money on a, another stability rather than... So we need to wait 275 before I spend it on my omen. Which would be... I don't even know what I'd do for an omen. What even would I do for an omen? 8k? We've had like a lot of pop-ups. So we were just going to quickly pause. Um, our Xenonid, that's good because they felt scorned. Um, I will do that from there. And I don't know where you are, but you're quite in that far in the north. And I will do this for now. Because the money is not actually as good as I thought it was. Okay, this will be an average. Uh, I think we'll win this. Yeah, we should win this. And this thousand from Sparta will never come to be of much use. Right, excellent. Now you go down south, go and deal with Sparta. Oh, that's actually a city. That is ridiculous. That's just like, actually he's counting as a city. And pretender support, we actually have another pretender. Oh, and you've been, he is a ge the general. He is a member of, imprisoned by Masson. Oh, I can release him. Uh, to be honest, mate, you're just not really that important to me. You're not even part of my faction. You're someone else. Um, Lucani, yeah, sure. Dardanian, no. Oh, this is actually a fort as well. Wow. There's a lot of forts. And Kaidoni has actually managed to uh, come south. Oh, come north, in fact. I might bring this army across just to support... Oh, his leader is disloyal. Oh, okay. Well, we will bribe him. Because I'm not having him just sitting around doing nothing. Yeah, that is the thing. Also, if your generals are not loyal, they will, uh, or admirals in this case, they will just do what they, of their own accord. So, you better keep them in check. You've got to keep them in check now. Technology speed. I might do technology speed. Just get this 9k across to come and support in the uh, wars, in the wars to come. Um, yeah, how old am I? Oh, 54. We better, better do some helping out, I imagine. And then you go down to Cytheria, whatever you're calling this place. I could, hmm, I bet I could probably just get that, yeah, I could, but I, I, I want more. Oh, no, we're going to have to go in. Beautiful. Beautiful. We'll do that, just keep him there, and then we will let this army get back to 15k, and then we might attack here in Kaidonia. Who's this? Ionia. Yeah, go for it. We'll do it. Kaidonia also thinks it can beat Macedon in a fight. Never gonna happen. Macedon will rule supreme over this area. <laughs> Whatever we're calling this area. Um, second Stratos, sixth Stratos. I don't know why you're sixth Stratos. Oh, but no, that's not the one I want to send. Second Stratos is the small one. Why are you sixth Stratos? Strange. Geez, so many people are dying. Have I got? A, I must have a really old core or something like that. A foreigner arrives. It's nice. We have a foreigner. Um, I will go there, two land here, we will do what we want. This is also a fort, this is part of Lacadamia. Um, I might, why would I do the other one? We'll put up with him, yeah, go for it. We also have a disloyal, oh yeah, still you. <laughs> There's no loyalty now. 
I'm not surprised. I could I should have you executed. Oh, he needs to be imprisoned. And I can't imprison him because... Um, oh, he's not a pretender. Oh, I can't imprison him because he's an, he, because he's an impre, a, a pretender. I can't imprison him. Okay. So basically, he's untouchable. Carthage is doing very well. It's taken out... Jeez, it's taken out a lot of territory up there. Actually, no. I say that. Carthage is being... Carthage is being occupied by Beleria is going to lose. This, and whoever these people are have come in and like stolen her, uh, their lands. Carthage is actually getting beaten back. I'm not down there though. It's doing okay there. Um, Rome's doing like nothing. <laughs> as usual. It's very passive in this game. They need to do a patch about that make it really, really well not really aggressive but more aggressive. If it's too aggressive, then um, I end up just wearing itself out. But we're not too far into the campaign, so we could we could see a big change. I've seen, I'm playing my own campaign as Rome, as I've already said quite a few times, and I'm about a hundred years ahead, and I'm not too much bigger. I'm, I'm getting there. I'm like down, I am down the Ionian coast into Greece, but I'm not going to Africa and stuff like that yet. Um, you sure? Um, oh, we can also religion, religion, we can sacrifice, which we will do. Okay. So we actually will get everything that we want now. So I'm going to sue for peace. And hey, oh no, we won't get this yet. You go in there. You... Who else are we at war with then? Oh, the other person got taken out by Messania. Jeez. I'm going to just send you back there. Go back there. Back to your homelands. 2,000 versus 9,000. You should win. I don't know. I just like the whole red and yellow thing. Like they've really messed around with it and I think they could. Like it's not the truth really. It needs to be occupied. It, it is occupied. It's very much occupied. There we go. Um, modernize. Yeah, we'll modernize the army. Um, and I will improve my popularity. Give him a job, or perhaps later. Aegis, who's Aegis? You're Aegis, and you're a member of that. Um, becomes Philopodol. I don't know what that is. Um, I'll say perhaps later. The other guy might die before, before the year is out. Um, also you, Boa. Do you like me enough now to? Oh, I just should. I'm just gonna. Oh no, I don't want to fabricate claim. Relations. I want to improve. I just want to integrate you all into the empire. The second Stratos, get back on this boat. Right, if we attack you now, who do we bring in? Oh, still bringing a lot of people. A lot of people I'd rather not bring in. If we bring in... To attack Tulantir, Mesepia now. I might move up north and take out Tulantir then. They're kind of my next go-to army. And this army has just got so much attrition wherever it goes. You go there. Oh, Okokaira. Has no allies. Yeah, Thessaly. Yeah, sure. Better Thespia just go there. Um... Hmm. We're doing alright. We're doing okay. We're 26. Um, that we can convert. We'll fabricate a claim. On there. And Illyria, Grecia. And we'll fabricate a claim on... Oh, Civics is expanded. Okay. Um, we will... Alliance. Influence. No, they wouldn't. 
So we'll do that one. We will fabricate a claim. And use up all of our herb power, basically. All of our oratory power. Just there. Straight away. Um, I can't declare war on them yet, but I will soon. People should rejoice. They should. We'll have even better stability. Thank you. So I wasted money <laughs> spending it on that, but at least we've got three now. So when my guy dies, um, we will be safe. I'm going to declare war on you. Take Epirus. And just go in. And we will... They're blockading the port so they can't get off because it takes a little bit. And then we can just roll them over. Just like that. And then I'll send you up here. Oh, another guy that we've got to send. I'm sending Aegis. The other guy is really good. There you go. Now the other guy can have his job that he desperately wanted. There he goes. I should have just done that earlier. But hey. You can't read into the future. Um, I will... I could do trade. Or national tax. National tax could help. I'm going to do trade for now. Bring in, bring in another trade route. So on four. Okay. That was... Uh, army's gone up. We can't do anything because we have no civic power. Of course. I always forget. So we just got to let that siege down. And then we're good. We're done. Um, you could do with some more arches in your army, I think. So, that will take you to 12,000. If we get you to 15,000, you'll be okay. So, we could put... Better look next time, yes. That's all I can say. You... Um... I'll put two of you in there. That takes the... X, uh, 14... Thousand and then attrition weight fifty percent. I will put in another silver. Actually, no, I won't. I will put in another heavy infantry because heavy infantry is what we're here for as Macedon. And hopefully that should be okay to look after him, and then he can stay there. And now I will do arms for hire. Recruit mercenary cost, or experience decay, or light cavalry defense. What does that do then? Try me in. Cavalry skirmish, heavy cavalry. And where's like the heavy infantry and stuff like that? Oh, it's down here. Heavy infantry maintenance cost. Um, I'm going to go for Tarantine cavalry. And then siege ability goes um, for the next one. That'll be good. Um... This is like all cavalry and light infantry and then mercenary maintenance. I've never really been a fan of mercenaries in any Paradox games like have permanently, so I'm definitely not going to keep that around. Grain? Do we need... We've got a surplus of grain, so we're okay there. That it always helps, I guess. To every cloud. Oh, we get some of that. Nice. I will sort that out in a minute. Um, cloth? Yeah, we'll get cloth from... I'll get it from there. Egypt's actually trading get trading in a lot of the stuff that I probably could desperately use to, like... Would like to hold on to, so... <laughs> I don't know if I will go to war with them, like, instantly. Okay, looting will be gentle. Yeah, let the looting be gentle. You're at 100%. Um, just take that for yourself. Um, just do that. Um, you go there. Actually, would I rather have you around here? I don't know. Actually, bring you in to there. Then we can send that army round to... I'll send this army round here. And then, um... We can attack Tulantir next. And take them out. And then we can go for Thrace. Thrace is still up for grabs. Oh, it's got allies now. In Egypt and Seleucid Empire. Oh well. We can't quite do Thrace yet, but we will we will get there. We could actually possibly go for Um Athens 
Uh -huh. Actually, Athens, I'm pretty sure, is guarded by Phrygia. Yeah. Phrygia needs to have another civil war before I could be comfortable going to war with it. The Seleucid Empire. I've never actually seen it collapse yet, though it's supposed to be destined to collapse, apparently. But I've got a, I've got a fair amount of Greece that needs to uh, still be conquered and Boa. We actually we're supposed to be improving relations. Where's this improvement of relations? May I ask? I spent good good uh, good stuff on this. Embassy established. Right. Oh, and it's in, at the maximum improved. Oh, I'm wasting money just to being that doing that then. Brilliant. Brilliant. We cannot guarantee subjects. How are we going to get this higher then? Oh, we should have done improvement of... Oh, yeah. I know which one I need to go for next. Um, also, you're just like dying there in the sea. Which we don't want. So you go around there. Right. I need to go for, in my inventions, which I can never remember where it is, technology. I need to go for... That one could be useful. Oh, it's not here anymore. I need to go for one of these, and then I need to go for... Di maybe Diplomatic Reputation might help. And then there's a couple up here that are very useful, actually. Shame that I'd have, like, no civic power. Um, economy... Yeah, it's a 30%. I cannot spend any pennies on that, really. And do we have a fort on this border? We don't. I could do with a fortress, like, here. Fortress here to match their fortress, and then this like western area is very safe because otherwise they can just get straight through all the way to um, Pella, which is my capital. And no one wants that. We don't want to see that. Um, is your loyalty going down still? It is. Um, I could reward the veterans. I'm really not that bothered. I'm looking who I could invade next as... Oh, actually, Aetolia owns quite a lot, doesn't it? No wonder. Um, if we go to war with Messenia, who do we bring in? Or Messenia? Oh, we bring in basically everyone that's left in Greece. I have a feeling that we will now. That's just inevitable. Um, there's nothing else I can offer these people to make them like me more. I think I'm like, if I send a gift, I'll send the gift. Oh, actually that does increase it a little bit over time, but not much. I need to, um, to do more. We'll declare war, take Illyria Greece because they have no allies. Excellent. That's going to be a really easy war. Beautiful. Macedon shall rule. But yes, we will uh, have to check up on... Um, I don't know what I was going with that, actually. No idea. I have to check on some of the alliances down here and see what's the easiest way to take them out. I might... Athens might be one of the easiest ways to go now that Phrygia is the only person looking after it. All these guys. Arcania. Yeah, that might be one way to go. It'd be a big war, though. I think anything that's left in Greece is now going to be technically a big war. Um, but hey, we can we can live with that. Ugh. Hopefully, we can win this war very sweetly and then we can get another one in before the episode is over. Not really kept an eye on the time for the episode, but we'll say like another 10 minutes, that should do. Um, see, if I chide him, he loses, oh, he gains loyalty, but I lose popularity. If I flog him, I just gain popularity and he loses a bit of health, but he actually doesn't hate me. I'll flog you. I'm sorry, I, it's a horrible thing to do, flogging someone, but it doesn't actually um, damage our like our hatred of each other 
Right, disloyal characters. You're actually a pretender. How have you got a claim to the throne? Not a clue. Oh, I could grant you citizenship status. You actually are not... Um... Yeah, go for it. You have, you have citizenship then. There you go. Well done you. And that's still going down though. Oh, he's now got a wife because of that. I maybe shouldn't have done that because then he wouldn't have got had kids. He might still have kids and I'll actually no, you stay there. Go back to Oh, these are all awful places. Okay, there we go. Just like that, you could have gone in. But hey. There you go, go in there. Um I will I will let it be a uh, room for really. I'll let them kill a few people off. Uh, kill them. Let them kill a few, one or two, you know. Um, actually, I'd like you to go stay here. You killed them, and then just take this region, and then we're done. Excellent. Another war won for Macedon, and that's probably as far north as I'm gonna go. Well, northwest certainly. Asenia, I'm probably gonna go to war with you very soon. So no. Oh, Paeonian Revolt again. Um, make the high, local power of Paeonian Revolt tribal. I could cancel tribal vassal, but hey. Um, I want to do diplomatic relations, so I can then do this one. Improve ma opinion maximum twenty percent, and there we go, hundred percent. Sue for peace. Excellent. And then we'll get as much money as possible. Because it doesn't do any damage. Um, aggressive expansion. Because we have maximum uh, popularity. Because we're doing so good. Um, you go back to Arcana, um, Ambrakia. You can... I'm going to put you in the north. Um, for now. I, because I think I'm going to go north before I go south against Greece again. Um... Yep, yeah, you be him. You're not too bad. You're humble. You've got an infection and you're abrasive. Okay, you should be okay then. You should be okay. I ha I accidentally in one of my campaigns um, that I played, in my I think it was my Rome campaign, I decided to uh, put a corrupt governor in charge and that was a bad move. Yeah, go for it. Let's just put some citizens or whatever in some nation there. Phrygia really... I don't know if we... We could probably take Phrygia's land. I'd rather just annihilate all the other people, though, that are, like... A threat. I don't know. Like, that are here, and then I'll take on Phrygia for its land in Greece. But it's... It's still so big. It's huge. Um, I'd like to... Look, we're making a fair amount of money. I'm going to do manpower again. I'm making take 500 a month. It's fairly good. I mean, it's actually very good. Um, I'm gonna do marketplace, get the tax up. In some of these places, and we get we're just getting gifts anyway. So that's how we're gonna have the our economy just done for us, gifting us every single second. Um, I would like to put you over here in Thebes, I think. Actually, hmm, no, I'm going to keep you up here in the north with the other army. You're wanting something. Um, yeah, you can have that, and yeah, you can have that. I'm going to cancel my tribal vassal status with these guys. I'd like to also, oh, we can't do it yet, to the 14th of January. That will be our time that we go to war with them. I should have possibly waited until they had not got to the war, but hey. You do what you got to do. Oh, they've got automated navy again. Oh, the stu- Can I change the commander yet? I probably could. Change the commander to someone that's actually better and likes me. They ha Why are you collapsed? 
I'm changing it to you because you actually like me. I'm not having a pretender in charge of my army anymore. I'm in charge of my navy. It's not a problem. Uh, convert fabricated claim on Paeonia. And we'll take their land and their children and whatever else. Whatever else we've got to take from them. And then we can use this as another little region of... They're just they're a bit annoying there. They, I could have kept them there, but they're just having a lot of problems of their own. I'd rather just annex them. You're a good general. You're a good general. You're really old. You're a bit younger. He's general as well as the second strat. He's the son of the general to the second. Strat. I'll send it. I'll send him, and then the son can take over. And your loyalty goes up. Good. And you're really corrupt. Wow. But you're loyal. So that's what matters. Can we declare war? We can. Take Paeonia. Excellent. Right. And then we just march in. So we'll do that. We'll just march in. And kill all their people. I sound so awful saying that, but hey. Nice. So, but we only go to war, I'm pretty sure, with the um, loyalists. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we're not actually at war with the rebels, so they will become just like their own thing. I'm going to just... Um, I'll put that, just do religious power. I don't want to lose stability for no reason. Better look nice time. Yeah, we sent like an old man, so that's just a bit. <laughs> it's like everyone else sent young strapping men to the Olympic Games. We sent an old man. Don't care. Do you think I care about um, what people think of Macedon at the Olympic Games? We're going to crush everyone that's left. So there is no Olympic Games. It's just me turning up. Ellis every single time wins. I'm going to kill that nation. I also don't know why I just accepted a trade with you, because I'm going to crush you next. Oh, well. Um, you probably... Uh, you don't hate me now. You just don't also like me enough for me to integrate you. I can't go there. You need to win that war still. Oh, there's a war being averted. Ah, nice. The war was averted by Carthage. Let's see what else is going on in the world while we wait. Oh wow, the uh, Odovis. Ah, actually, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that name. Are doing very, very well. They like got most of Wales, and like a fair amount of Southern Britain. And we want to, we want a war. We want a war. We want to, want a siege, a siege. Um, and then we'll pull you back, just so you can replenish. And also, we just don't need you there. Excellent. We won this. Um, so I'm gonna... Oh, that changed sides. Brilliant. Not what I wanted. I'm gonna take this really small bit of land and it's gonna be horrible, so I'm gonna have to go to war with these guys very soon. Oh, uh, How did that happen then? I'm gonna fabricate a claim just so I can go to war with you as well. I'll take you both out if I have to. Um, yeah, sure, Macedonia Secunda. I'm taking both these guys out right now. Because this is infuriating. They also, neither of them are strong enough to even fight against me. But oh well, we will, we can do this. Right, this is, um, okay, some people are dying nicely. Um, oh, you're my, um, my you're my son. Nice, um, unmarried ruler. Oh, my wife died. I think I'm gonna arrange a marriage with a really old person. By the looks of it, finesse, max friends, finesse, technology speed. But that goes up. National Freeman output and monthly corruption. Your oh, geez, you got cancer. Un unlucky for her. Um. I'm going to... I'll just go with 
hair, I think. Because Xenoners Zen hate me. They, they just got married. One of their people has just got married to my ruler. And they go, how dare you? All right, there you go. We're at war with these guys as well now. I've had it. I've flipping had it. And I might actually have to bring the larger army up because they just like all spawned like huge armies. Yep, we lost that battle because of that. <laughs> we actually lost that battle. Oh well. Oh, and we sent in. Oh, right. So that battle we lost. I thought we sent both armies in, but no. We just sent in the one. Okay, so now we send in this army to go and deal with this. I'll go here. You're still replenishing. Oh well, so these these revolters are actually probably stronger than the the loyalists, which is usually the case because that's how you're going to win a civil war. Did they lose land? I think they they had that land because there's two mosaics now. There's mosaic and mosaic. I think they might have. That's annoying. Right, and then oh, you're kidding me. I yeah. I can't see it. This is annoying. Assassinate costs monthly tyranny. I haven't even got a tyranny, so why would I do that? Um, I could do omen duration. Um, pay mass. I'm gonna do army maintenance for now. Because army maintenance down will always be is always helpful. Okay. Oh, these now they're like their own. They're their own thing. I'm just at war with pa Pannonia now, and it's just like a weird, a weird shade. Where's the other army? It's down here. Go over there. Got to do some sieges. Oh, right. We just, like, lost. <laughs> In that region, we lost a lot of stuff. But anyway, guys, we are going to have to uh, leave the episode there. We will wrap up the war with Paeonia in the next episode. I hope you've enjoyed. Um, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And if you're new around here, like I said, subscribe and hit the bell for notifications of all of the Imperator Rome campaign. Until next time, guys. See you guys later.